Hey guys, so it has been so long since I've done one of these things, so I wanted to get right back into it and make a video for you guys. It is the 1st of October, which means it has been three months since I've posted my first video on here. What has happened in these last three months? It's been absolutely crazy. So much has happened and I just feel like that was, that last three months is a solid chapter and I'm really excited. When I started this page, I, I didn't really know where it was gonna go, what was gonna happen, but so much has happened and it's absolutely incredible. I, I can't even uh, think about where I was about three months ago. So everything positive and really exciting. So what have I been doing for the last few weeks, which I haven't posted a video. I got to Sydney uh, over the last 10 days, something like that. I was working at a day camp called Camp Blue. It is an amazing camp where the kids just are able to have an amazing time. So Camp Blue runs two different camps at the moment, one in North Sydney and the other one at Manly where I was working. I was really lucky to be teaching glee and drama and the kids had an amazing time putting together these fun different activities, songs and games and it was just a lot of fun and I love working with the kids doing that kind of stuff so I always make uh, an effort to get back when I possibly can. I've worked four camps now and I'll definitely be back. Other activities the kids can do are things like surfing, parkour, spray paint. There's just so many different activities that the kids can do and an opportunity that you wouldn't really get to do on your own on the school holidays. So why not do it somewhere like Camp Blue with an amazing team of staff members and a great group of kids to be around. So if anybody's looking for anything for their kids to do over the school holidays and you are located in Sydney, check out Camp Blue. You will not be disappointed and it'll be a great opportunity for your kids to try some things they've never done or some new opportunities, make some new friends and go back to school on an absolute high after having the best school holidays that they've ever had. So check it out, give it a shot and who knows you might see me there. So what else did I do? I actually spent the following weekend at the Sydney Exhibition Centre where I worked at Oz Comic Con in Sydney. So Oz Comic Con is actually run uh, all around Australia. You have Perth, Melbourne, Sydney, Adelaide, and I think it's just a great opportunity for people who are fans of sci-fi, TV shows, anime, comics, all that kind of thing to kind of come together under one roof and just have an awesome day or weekend if you come for both days. It was a lot of fun. There are so many people out there getting dressed up really committing and there were some amazing costumes that I saw they even run the cosplay competitions where the winner actually got sent to Chicago to compete in America at the the actual comic-con for the best costume like how incredible is that that's amazing they actually do um, a lot of different things there uh, there's a lot of stalls a lot of stands selling t-shirts comics uh, memorabilia merchandise all that kind of stuff so I used to work for these guys years ago. I used to look after the celebrity guests that would come down. I'd make sure that they were okay the whole time and looked after. And I haven't worked with them for a few years. So I wanted to get back into uh, the conventions. And what better way than to work with the guys behind the stand selling the merchandise. And it was so much fun getting to see my friends again, uh, getting to be around that environment and just having a great weekend. I mean, how many times do you get to do that kind of thing? So I took the opportunity and I had an absolutely amazing time. So we are at the first of October, the last three months, solid chapter, completely happy with how it all turned out. Now let's start the next chapter and what's happened. The end of September slash the start of October really marks something extremely important to me and that is when all of my TV shows come back. I'm so excited. There are so many new TV shows as well as uh, returning TV shows that I can't wait to watch. My gosh, there's some great stuff out there. I finished the last season of Big Brother and I'm very happy with the result. And what that means is that Big Brother finishes and my favorite show starts back. Survivor, I'm such a big Survivor fan. Um, if anybody knows me really well, they'll know that. I've been watching it since I was 10 years old. I've watched every single episode. I'm a dedicated fan. I've met contestants. I've traveled over to America to be involved and I just absolutely love it. And I'm so excited for this brand new season, Survivor Second Chance. A lot of people think that after 31 seasons, how interesting could it be? Oh my, you don't know what you're missing out on because it is so exciting. I'm, I'm, I can't, blah, I can't even put words to it. It is so good this season and it's only had two episodes. This season is gonna be epic and I can't wait to see how it turns out. 
Other shows that I'm really excited about, Scream Queens has just started. So Scream Queens is a Ryan Murphy production. There are a lot of other people involved, but I've watched a lot of Ryan Murphy shows, including Nip Tuck, Glee, American Horror Story, The New Normal, and also his movie, The Normal Heart. And I've loved every single one of these shows, and I just think they're incredible. The people that get involved, the writing, the actors, it's just really entertaining, and I was not disappointed at all by the premiere of Scream Queens. I think it is definitely a new market when it comes to comedy horror, and I think they've hit the nail on the head. There's just an, enough amount of cheese and, and quirkiness. It's just, it's gonna be so good. I, I can't even fathom how much I'm enjoying this show, and I was really impressed by the, uh, the very first episode and the double episode. I'm really looking forward to the rest of the season and to see where else it goes from here. All right, guys, so that is just a little bit of where I'm at the last three months done the next three months bring it on october november december then 2016 where has the year gone all i know is that i'm freaking loving it and i can't wait to see where the rest of this year takes me and then where 2016 takes me all right guys thank you so much for watching uh we'll be back with some more videos please subscribe like this video and share it. Uh, if you like what you see, let everybody know and hopefully we can get a lot more people involved and I'll have some more videos posted for you guys. So thank you for watching and I'll catch you next time. See you later, bye.